We're down in Sway, just outside of Limington in Hampshire today, and we've just put up one of our eight foot by six foot tuck shop sheds. Now these sheds are based on our normal Gorilla Sheds eight foot by six foot apex shed. So as you'd expect from a company called Gorilla Sheds, uh, they're a good strong shed. The uh, difference with this shed is it's been converted, so it's got these uh, these serving hatches here on the side, uh, so that the kids can open those up, put a shelf in there and uh, serve out some uh, healthy snacks, which is what the government says they've got to do nowadays. So on this shed, you'll notice there's no hinges showing here. And that's because what we have got is we've got a continuous hinge here that's going from the top to the bottom of both of the shutters. There you go, it runs all the way down there. And we've also got exactly the same thing on the door here. So it runs all the way down the edge of the door. Now I'll open the door up. Uh, it's got that normal turn button on it and staple and hasp. Uh, the door is a double ledge and brace, nice thick fob, and you can see that that hinge there is running all the way down on the outside there. So that's that. Now inside the shed here, you've got these two shutters. Now the two shutters, I'm going to have to go over. You've got a turn button at the top, a turn button at the bottom, and that opens the, uh, the front up like that. And then we've got a shelf that goes on that I'll try and do this one handed. The shelf that just clips on the front there. There you go. So you've got a shelf for the uh, for the kids to serve from. The, let's do a talking on, on the inside. The framework on this shed is 32 millimeter. So it's 32 millimeters going that way, or an inch and a quarter. Uh, and it's 45 millimeters going that way. So it's an inch and three quarter. It's rounded four corners. So there's very little chance of uh, splinters. The roof of the shed has, is all tongued and grooved and the floor of the shed is also all tongued and grooved. As I said, the door has got a double ledge and brace cut to it. It's got uh, another piece going down here, but that just gives us something for that hinge to fit onto. So if I just close that door on, here you go. So that's that from the outside now, you can see You've got the shutters open now with the shelf in place these doors are catching at the bottom there so that door cannot shut round onto who's in there we do give the option of putting uh, a cabin hook across here to keep the doors in that sort of position but this school has opted not to have that so there you go that's an eight foot by six foot tuck shop shed we do make these to any size that you want uh the biggest one that we've done so far is a 12 foot by eight foot and that had double hitch hatches in it but uh, there you go, eight foot by six foot tuck, tuck, tuck shop shed.